So if you've hung out on my channel for any length of time, there's a good chance that you've heard me say that you don't quit when you get old, you get old when you quit. I absolutely believe this is true with BMX and it's becoming more and more evident as time goes on with more and more older riders getting back into BMX as well as people who never quit just continuing to age but continuing to maintain and even progress in a lot of cases. And with this, there is a group on Facebook called Ride On BMX and it is a group catered to older riders over the age of 30 that is put together and organized by Neil Waddington. They also have a website but this group is a huge community on Facebook with seven and a half thousand members over the age of 30. That's what this is. It is a group for older riders over the age of 30. And with a community like this comes some really awesome community oriented things that Neil has organized throughout the years. They have done in the past member edits where people submitted clips and then it was put together into a member edit with riders over the age of 30, 40, over the age of 50, even riders over the age of 60. And it's incredible. And I don't know if this is something that Neil has done in the past, but in 2022, there was a video contest where riders submitted a video and there was groups over 50s, over 40s, somewhere over 30s is here, over 30s, holy cow, and then over 40s, there's just, and look how many edits were submitted. I think if an open video contest happened, there might be this many for all age groups. So to have something like this happen is just incredible. And what I wanted to do today and the idea behind this was just reacting to Alan Sibley's over 50s group winning video. Alan is somebody who I've praised endlessly on this channel because he is what BMX is. He's over the age of 50, just turned 51, and he might love BMX more than most 14 year olds who are absolutely in love with it. He is constantly sending videos to me and I'm sure all kinds of other people in DMs on Instagram just to talk about how crazy they are. And he's constantly supporting and encouraging people online of all ages. And Alan is just what we can all aspire to be in BMX. So I wanted to watch his video and react to it. I haven't watched it yet. He is an absolute shredder who goes high, can do the craziest technical lip tricks that are out there, and he's just an all-around amazing rider. So let's take a look here at Alan Sibley's Over 50s winning edit. This contest was sponsored by Etnies, by the way. So we got the winner, Alan Sibley. He does take some hard falls, too. He broke a frame recently now he's on that tech bike co blasting tables like that was six feet out 900 taps a freaking like a 720 nose pick tap look at that the dude bounces around on his back wheel better than a five tap boomerang back in his three tap like power mower stuff but he can also do air tables and turn downs like five six feet out three in box jumps turn downs like the dude is amazing. What is that? What do you even call that? That's like a flatland trick, but on a lip. Look at this dude. And the fact that he represents and promotes like local companies too. Dead Sailor, Tech Bike Co. My buddy Trevor, that's not local to him, but local to me. X up to turn down over a dirt jump. Tire tap decades, 540 nose pick. 540 nose pick leaner, whatever you want to call that. Five tab decade on a bank. Like, what can I, what can you say? And he needed us a double decade on flat. Incredible, Alan. You're seriously so inspirational. And that's why I wanted to make this because I wanted to show people that you don't quit when you get old. You get old when you quit. Alan is such a perfect representation of that that anybody can see and be inspired by. Look at that air turn down. The dude rips. Alan, I know you're going to see this. Thank you for being you and just being as obsessed with BMX as you are.
So I hope that you enjoyed this reaction to Alan's video. Let me know in the comments down below if you think I should do more of these reactions. It's very easy for me to make these and they're fun to do. So I would enjoy making more of them. And if you want to see that, I would definitely make it happen. Also real quick here, I wanted to shout out the channel storefront that I have created. I have a run of shirts that's going that are going to be printed here in Ohio and then I will ship them out myself. They're screen printed by a fellow BMX writer. How cool is that and I'm working on some other stuff to have in the store and there's also a secret pre-order in there as well so thank you guys for the support Alan keep freaking killing it you are amazing I should also add because Alan's in the UK these are available to ship worldwide to a whole bunch of different companies countries so thank you all for watching and your constant support just through watching and uh, this one is pretty relevant to what we talked about today so Thank you for the support. We'll see you tomorrow for another video. Goodbye.